Hello everyone, I hope you're having a wonderful morning, day or night. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to do the dumbbell flat and incline bench. The first cue I'm going to be teaching you, that's going to be important for both of them, is getting your ribcage up. Bring your chest up and ribcage up. And then put your hand right under your armpit and right to your lat. Push forward, pull back, push forward, pull back. You'll feel the lat engage and where it is. So, since you know how air your lat is now, when you're coming down for a lot of this, these exercises, you're gonna be packing the lats and then pushing forward and squeezing your pecs and pushing with your lats coming up. So, remember the cue, ribcage up for the next part of the video. Now I'm gonna show you the position where you start out on the dumbbell flat bench. It's important to start on the edge of the bench. Bring the weights up to your thighs. And then you're gonna kick back the weight, lay on your chest, and then pick up your hips and slide down on the bench so your back is retracted and depressed, getting your rib cage up. Now you're gonna begin. Your feet are gonna be pressing forwards and tightening with your thighs. That tension will give you more power for your dumbbell bench. Keep your legs pressing on the ground and your thighs constantly tense with your rib cage up. When you're coming down, your wrists should be aligned with your elbows. You're coming straight down and aligning with your lats also and then pressing back up. And then back up. Segment I'm gonna be showing you where their hand position should be on the dumbbell flat bench. So it's gonna be, this is a pronated position. In this pronated position, you wanna be tilting it just a little bit inside like this. And then coming down slow and controlled near your sternum and then extend up. Slight bent. Coming down, and then back up. It shouldn't be a complete neutral position like this, or you're, or too pronated where you're flaring out in your shoulders. It should be a slight bent aligned with your lats, packing your lats, and then shooting back up with your lats and squeezing your pecs together. What you should watch out for on the dumbbell flat bench is Clanking the weight like this. Just come down with your lats and pecs and just squeeze together. Now I'm gonna show you the incline dumbbell segment of the video. Now, go find the lever on the bottom of the bench. Bring it up one or two levels. It should be at a 30 or 15 degree angle. I usually like a 15 degree angle. In this part of the video, I'm gonna be showing you how to do the dumbbell incline bench. You're gonna pick up the weights, put them on your thighs, and then you're gonna kick them up. Just like this, rib cage up, retracting, depressing your shoulder blades, and then pressing. Your hands should be positioned just like you were in dumbbell flat bench. Slight bent in the pronated position. Stack your wrists, elbows, and lats together. Come down really, Get your rib cage up. Squeeze together with your lats and pecs. Pack your lats and then press with your lats and squeeze your pecs right away. Don't clank them. Don't let your, your wrist go inwards. And don't press with mainly your triceps. Pack your lats. Rest with your lats and pecs. Really get your rib cage up. Chin tucked in and press. Coming down. Up. And you notice how my rib cage is up. It's allowing me to go a lot deeper. But if your shoulder blades were protracted and forward, you're gonna be using a lot of your front delt. So I'll give you an example right now. I'm keeping it flat, no rib cage up, no retraction or depression with the shoulder blades. I'm gonna be flaring. It doesn't allow me to get that natural 
tucked in elbows like I did when I got my rib cage up. So going back to the, the wrong position again, I'm gonna try and get my elbows in, but naturally they wanna just stay flared out. Now allowing me to pack my lats and rip my pecs down and then squeezing back up together. Position of the dumbbell incline bench. So you can see. <clears throat> really keeping my chin tucked in and my core centered, pressing up and not leaning towards one favorable side. <clears throat> 